Hey, I'm Catherine Newton. And I'm Cole Sprouse. And we're from the new movie, Lisa Frankenstein, in theaters February 9th. And we're here with IMDb to ask each other anything. There's a young man. I talked to him. I wish I was with you. That's really weird, Lisa. How would Zack and Cody react to the creature? I think it would be uh, sort of like a Home Alone vibe until uh, the zombies completely overwhelmed them and ripped them limb from limb and devoured them. That's so intense, isn't it? You want to yeah. pitch it to Disney? Yeah, I think they're going to bite. I think so. <laughs> no pun intended. I have an idea. Your turn. Okay. Uh, Ask me a question. Okay, okay, okay. Do you have a favorite zombie movie? There's one that's um, it's funny. What's the one? Shaun of the Dead? Yeah. I love that one. I love that movie. Oh. You ever see 28 Days Later? No. It's a, it's a serious zombie movie. Yeah, maybe it's too scary. It might be too scary. Are you not a scary movie, girl? Listen, I will go, but I'm not going alone. No way, no how. I want to hold hands, I want to cuddle, and I want to throw popcorn everywhere. Yeah, that's what I want. I don't want to watch the movie. I just want to hold hands. I went to the premiere of Insidious by myself because I was working on Paranormal Activity 4. I saw that movie by myself. Oh my god. Is that? I was like 15. Oh, that one's really good. It's so good. Was that the movie that gave you nightmares? Yeah. They all give her nightmares. They all give Fantastic. me nightmares. Did you know this going in? That No. That you didn't know I, anything about me. No, I know you didn't like horror movies. Who who likes them? You people are I insane. Them. I love them. It is the hot sauce of movies. You like, like hot sauce? I love it. I, I like I hot Cheetos. Spice. I, I like I like a little bit of punishment. You know what I mean? I go to Don't extrapolate on that. Listen. Don't follow that line of thinking. You hear that? I'm sure it's the girl next door. She's very odd. Do you have any hobbies besides being an actor named Cole Sprouse? No. No. Um, I have recently. Like, what do you do? Look I think this is a byproduct of me hitting my 30s. But I love pickling. What do you mean, pickleball? The fastest growing sport in the US. Oh, no. No, 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 not pickleball. <laughs> the act of pickling vegetables. Cole. You don't understand. I love it. I love it. How do you do it? What do you pickle right now? Everything. My favorite is you hard boil eggs, stay with me, and then you pickle them in beet juice with the vinegar. Uh, Everyone and just turned this interview off. A little pickling spice. All right, and we then... got it. Moving on, next question. Okay. Ask me one. Okay. <laughs> um, Are you going to bring me a jar of pickles? Not anymore. You <laughs> all over my pickling hobby. You know what they say about pickles? <laughs> pickles are just cucumbers soaked in evil. You know? <laughs> Why would you say that to me? Did you steal anything from set? Would I ever tell? I took her shoes. I've never worn them, though. They're Lisa's shoes. They're not really mine, you know? Mm -hmm. Did you steal anything from set? Yeah, I took some of the... Um, Knew it. ...the original busts that were used as makeup tests for the practical effects. First off, I'm a huge Legacy Effects fan, and they were the house that did this one. And I'm also just a big practical effects fan in general. I'm a monster movie really guy. Cool. It was cool. I didn't really mind sitting legends. in the chair. Like, <laughs> they can't make you better. I mean, they can, but like emotionally. <laughs> if you could do a rom-com with any actress, who would it be? Ryan Gosling. <laughs> no. If you could do a rom-com with any actress. Oh, actress. <laughs> Oops. Um, Oops. Any actress. Um, any, any of them. Probably not Catherine Newton. Next question. Let's talk about Big Little Lies. Okay. Were you nervous? I was nervous at the table read that I wasn't going to be loud because I was on a sitcom and on the sitcoms I'd see people not say a joke or not be loud and no one caught it in the audience so then their lines would get cut. You know what I mean? If it wasn't funny, you'd get cut. So I just remember it was the biggest table read you've ever seen in your life. Like there's 50 people on that show yeah. and I just was going to belt out my lines <laughs> so yeah. that I didn't miss any of them. So You're like um, Big Little Lines. They... On this list, I have uh, this person, Zelda Williams. Have mm. you ever heard of her? What is that girl about, huh? Do you want to know the truth? Yes. When I first met her, we haven't told too many people this, but Tell me. I was 16. My brother and I were like walking to an event or something. Right. I looked 12 oh. and I had a bowl cut probably still. And I saw her outside of a bar and I went up to her and I went, Hey, can I have a cigarette? And she went, No. <laughs> and I went, Whatever. And walked off. That's. The first time you we said ever met. whatever. Yeah, and then 
you know, flash forward however many years later, we well, became fast friends. And she told me this like two years ago. I have a similar story when I met Cole. I was also asking him for something, um, a photo. We were seven years old. I got a picture with him and his brother. So I won. Where right in between the it? two of you, at Bob's, Bob's Big, Big Boy. Boy. Iconic. I was, I was a little punk. I love it. No? What's the best Valentine's Day you've ever had? Mmm. Like, what's the most dramatic one, you know? I did you know? Napa. You went to Napa? Napa. Wine country? Yeah. That's cute. That was really cute. Like a wine tasting thing? I'm not going to say too much. You can't spoil the, the beauty of it, you know? Are you a planner or are you... I'm a grand gesture person, for sure. Or like an event person. Like, I, I like experiences. I'm not, I'm not really a big gift person. Are you a gift person? Yeah. <laughs> I am. I am a gift person. But I'd like to be an experienced person. I just feel like the memories last a little longer. For sure. Flowers die. Damn. <laughs> but it's always nice to get them. It's a waste of time to try and fix a boy. It's better just accept a guy's flaws. Oh, that's so cute. This just says Netflix and chill. Uh, if you were to pick a movie for Netflix and chill. I want to watch something I want to turn off. You know what I mean? If you're going to Netflix and chill, right? Why would you turn on Riverdale, then? <laughs> he did that. That was all him. I'm a little terrified by the social experiment of it all, but I, I, I think it's good. Oh, my God. I have a question. Please. Okay. Have you ever watched yourself oh. with someone on a date? No, but I recently did something that I haven't done in ages, which was my girlfriend and I, it was around Christmas time, and apparently one of those old direct to DVD movies I did as a kid called I Saw Mommy Kissing Santa Claus. Oh, cute. This was a golden time where you could just do a movie and it would end up in the back of Blockbuster. Right, and, I right? miss those days. Well, it had a full Lisa Frankenstein resurrection <laughs> on Amazon Prime. And I just turned it on in the background and I, I just said, ah, this, is one of my, this is one of my favorite Christmas movies. I do not <laughs> watch myself. I have a really hard time. When we sat down for dinner, it eventually clicked in and she was like, is that Hey, you? That's I so like cute. A little baby. That's so cute. Little baby. At least you were little, you know? It's not like modern day. I was that height until around 19. <laughs> I couldn't tell my brother and I apart. This is back when we used to play the same part. A lot easier now. I'm one of those people that, like, you guys don't look that much alike to me anymore, right? Mm -mm. Not. But yeah. I'm sure at the time when I met you when I was seven, I didn't ask for a picture with Cole, I just a picture with you, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Specific about it. Yeah. Did you remember the experience of the photo? He's gonna say yes, right? Yes, you did. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. No, I was not um, of note. Okay. And now you, he can't forget you. <laughs> I didn't tell him about the photo until like weeks into filming. On the set of Lisa Frankenstein, I didn't tell him this. Yeah, until recently. Yeah, I didn't want to be uncool. What was your favorite show or movie of Cole's at that time? Oh, Sweet Life. Sweet Life, yeah. yeah for sure. Absolutely. It was Sweet Life of Zack and Cody era. It wasn't even yeah. Sweet Life on deck yet, okay? Yeah. You know, they were the coolest kids I ever saw. They were Yeah, rock I look stars. at old pictures up here and I say, that is the epitome of cool. You guys were so cute. I mean, come on. Right? One good thing came out of this. What? Zombie! Where? <laughs> okay, so, golf versus the creature. Do you think Lisa could beat the creature at golf? I bet the creature's a great golfer. I feel like he has that kind of mechanical joint work. Yeah. That could really get the same shot every time. What about Catherine Newton versus the creature? No way, Catherine would. I think the creature's gonna win every time. He's been playing golf for millions of years. Millions. No. <laughs> millions. <laughs> okay, I mean golf was invented in, you know, not that long ago. You don't know, you know. The monks uh, started the game back in Scotland. The Royal and Ancient Golf Club, yeah. Monks started golf. Monks? Kind of monks, the monks. If you could come up with another movie title for Lisa Frankenstein, what would it be? Lisa Frankenstein's such a great title. I uh, know, it's Because, you know, kind of, Lisa Frank. Yeah, it's kind of perfect. It's kind of perfect, so good luck. I would say uh, Catherine Newton. Catherine Newton's big day. <laughs> <laughs> Is that. Is that yeah, was I, you know, like when they get toddlers to do tasks? Like yeah, that. Yeah, that's that's TV. Show. <laughs> Catherine, Catherine Newton. <laughs> That's what I'd turn on for Netflix and chill. Yeah, yeah. Catherine's big day. Catherine Newton's big day. Yeah. I'm not making any more comments. You can talk to my lawyer. Hey guys, if you like this video, like and subscribe to IMDb.